Oh, he's in a high gear. You'll be grateful for the e-bike for this first bit. She's e full stop. Yeah. yeah. Definitely autumn. E -bike's good. <laughs> It's not as steep as I remember. We will definitely need to stop here to have a little gander down at Lochaba. Whatever smells like a park tank or two. I think. <laughs> yeah. Oh. E bikes. We've we've not earned it. We've not earned it. It's e-bikes. <laughs> yeah, yeah. <sighs> okay, so today me and Pierce are back out on the bikes. It's the e-bikes again uh, because Pierce is hungover and I am once again recovering from a little bit of sickness, which is uh, starting to wear a bit thin. Anyway, the good news is we have a stunning, calm autumnal day with all the oranges you could ever want uh, on the trees behind us um, and we are heading for the CIC hut at the base of Ben Nevis, the north face of Ben Nevis which is a pretty spectacular location so hopefully we get the views up there see the cliffs, see the hut get the good kind of uh, mountain pass trail back down and then finish off with some kind of natural enduro trails that the likes of the, the local uh, whippets around here, Michaela Parton and Joe Barnes and whatnot, they ride these kind of trails here. Uh, they are very raw, very natural, just hand cut uh, enduro trails. So we're going to try and hit some different ones here, the ones that I haven't hit before. And that should round off what hopefully will be an excellent day in the bikes. I'm sure it will. There she is. Ben Nevis. For all you can see of it. Right, we've got a fairly engaging climb here. Plenty of drainage ditches. But overall the gradient is actually pretty good. And you can totally cycle up a good chunk of it. That's the hope. <laughs> I cannot pass you there. <laughs> He's off there, drink, big man. You know, see when you're not hungover, this is perfect. Yeah. yeah. You just have to take my word for it. I was sandwiched. For me, at my skill level and fitness level. This is kind of the perfect scenario for an e-bike. I am not fit enough, I'm not fit enough, proper grammar, to uh, cycle up all of this on a regular bike. Of course I can do this bit, but the technical sections, I don't know if I've got the fitness to maintain the momentum, etc, etc. But I do have the skill to ride it, and that's where the e-bike comes in. Was calm. Woo! So we've got the classic mountain scenario playing out here. Uh, when we were down in Fort William itself, the the water was like a sheet of glass. Absolutely still no wind and it probably still is but now that we are getting ourselves up into the mountains there's a good steady 15 20 mile an hour wind here now and that's just mountains for you so the trail is getting steeper and bumpier as are the cliffs We're almost there.
ホームスだはいどうぞ。So, this is the Charles Inglis Clark Memorial Hut. Clearly runs off gas. <laughs> I think they helicopter this stuff in. You can book this place. Uh, yeah. Looks pretty cool inside. Yeah, you can book this place. It's not expensive, it's like 20 quid a night or something. And uh, predominantly used for people who are going to rock climb up the north face. Insert time lapse. <laughs> uh, yeah, so we're about 2,200 feet up at this point at the hut, and uh, Ben Nevis is over 4,400 feet, so we're only halfway, and those cliffs you see ahead of you are uh, over 2,200 feet, or there or thereabouts, which is pretty spectacular. We've got big, big mountain feel, but without big mountain effort, because that is a relatively easy path to come up, all things considered. Also, we've got, obviously, the energy of the wind turbine, solar panels, another wee wind turbine, and there's the webcam for looking to see what conditions are like up yonder. Right, can't stay up here all day as much as I'd like to. Are you feeling it? <laughs> when I say it, I mean sickness. I feel something, yeah. Nausea. Yeah. Cool. Right, I'll get you down at the stream. Hopefully. Straight in. Oh. Again, all the rides I do up in the mountains start off extremely full on. Never get any warm up. Setting the tone though. Ooh. Through the stream. <laughs> <laughs> Do this one. Oh. 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 Get the pattern. We were taking our time. The water bars are uh, interesting, aren't they? They are, yeah, interesting's the word, yeah. <laughs> you are almost there. Oh, yeah, yeah. Oh, almost there. <laughs> Cheers. How you doing? Cheers. Those are the people we met at the first bench way down in the woods. Nice, nicely done. Big suspension soaking it all up. Nicely done. Oh, nearly. Thank you. Cheers. <laughs> Oh, you see? 
Nice one. Alright, cheers. See ya. <laughs> you should have stayed home, mate. Pierce has ridden many a time hungover, but this is the, the worst I've seen him. It's almost like alcohol's bad for you. Ah, oh, damn it. I oh, know, it's okay, we'll get that. Wasn't the way I wanted to hop it, but made it all the same. Trying to be gentle on the brakes so that I don't skid the place up. Oh, nice. It's a big hop for a 26 kilo bike. My arms stayed in their sockets. Here we go. Oh, lovely. Again, yeah, now I've got the big travel bikes. Stuff like that is much, much easier. Suspension does a lot of the work. Nice. No. Gonna try that again. I want to be tight to the right hand side so I want to make sure I'm out on the left like so hop oh. I dabbed but do you know what that's not bad it's not bad For all the bikes I've taken up here, I think this one is carrying the best momentum. I mean, obviously, the fact that it's a heavy e bike plays right into that. But I think it's better than the pivot was and the old Levo. That's the way it should be, isn't it? Newer one should be better. Scanning. Oh, too fast. Oh, oh. Go. Oh my god. Woo. Okay, I'll get you the car. Right. Pierce is uh, <laughs> really not feeling it, so he's going to go down the footpath uh, straight to the car. And I will see if I can find some enduro trails. I did not know. That this trail went so far up, like high. Wow.
Ooh. Right, I'm going to assume that this is the back to school trail. <laughs> right, hopefully it's not too dark. Deep. <laughs> I'm not riding very confident here. Cool. Oh no. Missed it. <laughs> oh no, 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 no. Wow. <laughs> no. That is very deep. I think this trail is going to take me back to school. But not in the fucking way I'd hope. But I never want to go back to school. <laughs> oh. Oh. Right. Oh. Oh. There are so many lines. Man, there's not much visibility here. Oh no, terrible. Ooh. Okay, that's <laughs> I'm not the only person to do that. Wow. Right, at least we've got some light now. Might help a touch. Yeah, it definitely does help. Oh, oh man, no way. No way. No way. <laughs> So I thought that day would be pretty eclectic with the out in the mountain start and the in the woods finish. Uh, but the in the woods finish was way more brutal than I had anticipated. Couldn't really see too well, wasn't riding well, uh, it was very slippy, very tough, quite humbling. Uh, I am not good enough for those trails at the moment. I'll need to come back maybe on the regular bike and uh, try and suss them out first. But overall, pretty good. Not for Pierce, he's still very hungover, but uh, good for me. Ciao.